Hey Vista, welcome back to our special fall broadcast. Say goodbye to hot temperatures and spontaneous tornadoes, and hello to cooler weather. Any wise words for them, Miles? As the leaves begin to paint the world in shades of red and gold, we invite you to join us on a journey through this enchanting season. From cozy fireside moments to the vibrant colors of nature's palette, we'll be a guide to all things autumn. So grab a warm drink and settle in, and let the magic of fall unfold before your eyes and ears. Our school is participating in the One Book, One District event this year. Part of this event is a district-wide community service project to collect toiletries for those in need. Our, if our high school collects the most toiletries, we can win $500 to purchase books for our school library. Here are the details. Hi, my name is Madison. Hi, my name is Jamal. And my name is Bryson. Hi, my name is Sophia. My name is Hunter. My name is Asher. Hi, my name is Sumner. Hi, my name is Ellie. We are from Vail, and we're so excited to help launch Douglas County's One Book, One District. This year, we're exploring Cy Montgomery's book, Becoming a Good Creature. The book's theme is all about becoming a good creature, and we are taking that to heart. Douglas County is partnering with Secor Cares, an incredible organization in Parker, Colorado. Last year alone, Secor has provided over 55,000 meals to families in need. They've helped hundreds of families get back on their feet in tough times. You can help us with our Good Creatures theme by asking your parents if they can donate to our personal hygiene drives. We're asking you to donate personal hygiene items and help us support our neighbors in need. We're in need of personal hygiene products such as diapers, toothpaste, shampoo, chapstick, and other personal hygiene items. You can help by bringing donations to your school library between October 1st and November 16th. You can get more details by asking your school librarian. The school that collects the most donations will receive $500 worth of books for their libraries. Remember, every little bit counts. Your support helps families right in our community. Your generosity today will help make a brighter tomorrow for everyone in our community. So let's become good creatures and make a positive impact. Together, we can make a significant difference. Thank you for your time and consideration. Your support means the world to us and the families we are helping. Thank you. Key Club meets the first Tuesday of every month. The next meeting is October 3rd at 7.35 in the auditorium. Thanks for all those who donated this week during the blood drive. There is a critical blood shortage right now, and each donation has the potential to save up to three lives. Girls Swim and Dive will be having an informational meeting during Eagle Time today. All girls interested in joining the team this season, or any who want to know more about the team, are welcome to attend. Our Diversity Club has had a lot of questions about diversity, so they put together this informational video to answer those questions. We are MVHS's Diversity Club, and we are here to explain diversity. According to the Oxford English Dictionary, diversity is defined as the practice or quality of including or involving people from a range of different social and ethnic backgrounds and of different gender, sexualities, etc. But what does it mean to Diversity Club? What does diversity mean to you? Uh, diversity to me is the differences, uh, is simply the differences between people. Diversity is like including everyone. Forgetting about comparison. A community that we can all be a part of. Celebrating each other's differences. It's accepting others regardless of who they are. Diversity in one word from Vista students. Um, inclusion. Respect. Respect. Embrace. Unity. Opportunity. Opportunity. Community. Empowering. Change. 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 What we do in Diversity Club is celebrate our differences by spreading awareness through posters, videos, and online posts. We celebrate cultural diversity through food, music, dancing, and special events. If you're interested, please join us in Upper 309 every Wednesday going from 3 to 4 p.m. Seniors, did you know that over 30 Colorado colleges and universities will waive their application fee from October 17th to October 19th for Colorado students? This is an excellent opportunity to apply early and take advantage of the cost savings. Counselors will be available Tuesday, October 3rd and Thursday, October 12th during Eagle Time in front of the counseling office to answer any application questions. The following college reps will visit next week. Ohio State, University of California, Irvine, Purdue, 
Vanderbilt, Florida State Institute of Technology, Pepperdine, and the University of Illinois at Urbana. Be sure to register for the visit on Naviance and show the confirmation to your teacher to get out of class. The college fair is Saturday, October 7th with over 150 colleges in attendance. Check your email for more information on the list of attendees and how to sign up. Hey Vista, Grayson here. Seniors, make sure you get your senior pictures in by Thursday, October 5th. The submission link is in your email. Interested in law or criminal justice? Come to the mock trial meeting today at 3 p.m. in Lower 506. Students will have the opportunity to study realistic court cases and prepare for the trial in February at Douglas County Courthouse. Court adjourned. Varsity football takes on our little brother down the street on Friday at 7 p.m. at halftime home. Make sure to buy your ticket in advance because it will sell out. That's, That's all, all for this week, Mountain Vista. Vista. We will see you next time. time.